Yo, what is up, YouTube? My name is Aaron, and today we're going to be talking about uh, DLC, G sliding, and a few other things regarding multiplayer. So, uh, I guess to break this in, let's go ahead and talk about G sliding. So, what a G slide is, is basically where you run, you jump into the air, you hold the B button or paddle, whatever you use. And right before you hit the ground, you press A. That's about as easy as it is. And uh, I'm not perfect. I can get them. I think the best in a row I've ever done was seven. So uh, you can just go and try that. Go to any random map and just keep running and try them again. Um, so you do that and it boosts you forward significantly. Like it's almost double that of a slide in time to get somewhere. And uh, to, as an example... If you guys know, the uh, in the hut in Hunted, or actually several of the hunts, if you can hit two G slides before you get there, that's going to put you there before anyone else can get there. So that's pretty significant if you don't know that. I mean, you get there with a sniper or an M8, and that's really, really significant. In fact, it's not just limited to Hunted. It's pretty much any map right there on screen was an example of a G slide. So if you can hit these things back to back to back, you can get places before anyone else can. And sadly enough, they're banning it or they're taking it away. They are updating it. They're removing it from the game because technically it is broken. They didn't mean for that to happen. It was just uh, something that went wrong with their jump slide mechanic. But I don't think they should. I think this is something that gives you a competitive edge. That's what separates one person from a noob. You know, you still have to practice to get it. It's not like... A mod it's not like a modded controller does it for you it's something you have to be good at I mean you can do it with a normal controller or a scuff or an elite it's something anyone can do you just need to get good at it and I think that's really what Call of Duty is about I mean whether you're having great gun skill or you know what gun to use in certain situations I feel like it's a part of the game almost like and it's a huge part of the competitive scene so uh, I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do there whenever playing competitive but you know it was fun while it lasted I enjoy it. I think it's really fun to do uh, but the next part of this video and it's going to be released a new update to fix that is right along with the brand new DLC so as you know there are four maps coming out they look sick Der Isendrak or Der Isendrahi is coming out I cannot wait to play that I will have to wait 30 days I I do not have it next week I really wish I did like I really wish I could get you guys premium video on that day so if anyone out there has a PS4 and you also have uh, some form of recording device whether you use like the PS4 share button to YouTube I guess um, record some gameplay of Der Isendrak and uh, let me know in the comment section if I can use it like telling me it's on your channel I'll go subscribe like the video I'll shout you out and I think that's really gonna help the channel I can look at it tell you guys what I think uh, and totally I'll have the channels down of the video I use but that's gonna have to do until you know 30 days later and then I can get my hands on it and we can see if we can go for some world records so that's my big goal for Darius and Drahi or Drake or whatever you want to call it is to get some world records I think um, for a map that size uh, the traps that I've seen so far and the fact that there's a pan strike, um, maybe it should be right around 100 honestly by the time I get to play it so definitely gonna have to get like a 110 115 hopefully I I've been wanting that round forever like element 115 I think it'd be really really cool to have so that's about it so this gameplay right here is search and destroy and it was pretty good gameplay I think I went 16 and 5 16 and 4 somewhere right in there double XP weekend I really didn't get to enjoy that much of double XP weekend I stream PC I played PC um, I worked on an up-and-coming game uh, I hope to release very soon uh, I am gonna be working on that this time like I'm gonna be putting in work on that game uh, to bring it to you guys there's not really a title yet I have an idea for it and if you guys want to know well, let's get this video to 30 likes if you want to know that idea if you want to be a part of making a actual video game with me uh, let me know down below also if you want me to do some uh, YouTube videos on it which of course I am you know no know, knowing me I'm, I'm gonna put it on YouTube but I just that's that's all I really have to say G sliding DLC new game 30 likes can we get it World records, I cannot wait. I really hate to see the G-Slide go. Uh, it's really, really fun, honestly. It's something that before I was able to do it, or before I knew how to do it, I was like, oh man, that's cheating, that's so unfair. But 
I kind of thought, you know, it's something you gotta learn. And that's, that's what Call of Duty is about. So, hopefully I can leave you guys there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay. It's a little bit different from, um, from Zombies. But it is Search and Destroy. I love Search and Destroy. One of my favorite game types to play on this game. I really think Search and Destroy is really, really good. I do wish it went to, um to six points instead of four. I think that's the only thing I could correct about this game. We did end up losing the game. I anti-clutched. Hope you guys enjoy this. I will see you tomorrow with a brand new video.